In this video we will train for the wrist plank and the forearm plank. Step 1. Come down on your knees, forearms and elbows. Bring your body weight forward towards your elbows and back, forward and back. Repeat 20 times. In this exercise we're training our shoulders to carry our body weight. The next part is strengthening the wrist. First we need to make sure we have a nice range of motion in the wrist. Put your palms down, bring your body weight over the wrists, shoulders come just over the wrists and back. Repeat 20 times. Come up on your knees and release your wrists. This will be done at the end of each step. Step number 2. Back on your knees and elbows, this time the elbows go further away and your body weight comes forward and back, but this time there's more body weight on your shoulders and elbows. Repeat 20 times. Come up on your wrists, do the same thing, take your wrists further away and bring your body weight forward and back. Repeat 20 times. Slowly, slowly, your wrists are getting used to more body weight. And finish with the circles. Step number 3. Begin with a few repetitions of step number 2. Then dig your toes into the floor and lift up knee after knee one at a time and lower down one at a time. Repeat 10 times. Do the same on your wrists. Lift one knee, add the other, then lower one knee and lower the other. Repeat this 10 times as well. Continue with this step for 3 days and then proceed to step number 4. And finish with a wrist recovery. Step 4. Come up to a forearm plank, hold up for 2 seconds and down for 2. Same on the wrist, come up for 2 seconds and down for 2. Repeat 5 times. The next steps will be gradually lengthening the duration of the plank. Do each step for 3 days and then continue to the next one. 5. 4 second plank, 4 second rest, 5 repetitions on each sort of plank. 6. 7 second plank on forearms and then on wrist, 7 second rest, 3 repetitions of each. 7. 3 repetitions of a 10 second plank on each forearms and then wrists. Congratulations, now you can plank. Last thing, avoid these common mistakes. The lower back tends to arch when you bring your body forward. Try to push your tailbone down and flatten your back. You may be able to fix it, but as the body weight comes forward, we might arch again. Make sure you keep that tailbone down and keep the back flat. Another issue is when shoulders come up to your ears. Try to keep your shoulders away from your ears and think of having a long neck. Another very common issue is locked elbows. Try to keep your elbows always slightly bent. Many times all these three come together. Elbows are locked, shoulders shrugged up and our back arches. Try to be aware to get the maximum of your plank. Good luck!